Welcome to part four of this amazing series. Uh, where we last left off, we just invaded Saxony. Or the kingdom of Saxony. And now we are going to push by Hanover. And right after we push for Hanover, we shall form... Not Germany, but something close to Germany. Although in real life, that Germany had this state right here. Um, most of your people who know history probably know who that is. Okay, let's do annex 10 wins. Okay, they accept it. Why do I not have more than that? I mean, come on, man. Kill to the people for war. I mean, I could do they have taken long enough. Oh! I think this is the first time I have seen this happen. Yes, Gustav, Gustav the Fifth enacts itself in the city. Who they taunt? Due to the lack of stabilities and blah blah blah, a new potential ally. I'll just do this, just because I know I'm going to be making summaries and whatnot. Okay. Um, no, I kind of need to do this, so I'm going to do that. Okay, so whenever I get to... Uh, okay, is this my joking with me? I mean, I know people know that this is funny and what, whatnot, but, like, I don't really understand it, but whatever. I need 70 war support. And I thought I saw, let's say, um, 71. No. Oh, that. No. Why do I think it's a 96? You know, never mind. Um, I want to make threatening noises. But whenever I win this battle, win, win this mini war, I shall take over Hanover and form Confederation. Argentina invades Uruguay. Nice. Oh, but yield. Uh, oh, oh, oh! Would you look at that? Russians Workers Republic. Lenin, you, you dirty dog! You done it. All right. You know what? Well, I don't really think that makes sense, but whatever. So you went all the way down here. Lenin, so you have two options. You can do one in the negotiator. Yeah, we got Lenin the Iron Hearted. Which I'm probably going to do Lenin the Iron Hearted. But, um, you know how I, uh, so, but remember we're going in a bit of an order. We are going from Austria, um, right after... Uh, right after we finish off Prussia, if we win, we lose. We'll be doing, uh, af right after Aust Austria, we will be doing Yield uh, Russia. And right after that, we will be doing the French. Okay, let's get this done, and then we could do, uh, the Blade and the Ford. Um, the Hamburg Conference. They're... As the forces of Prussia are closing on the king, they are right. They are playing right into Rush, Prussia's hand. So, um, uh, are the British out of there? Yes. The liber liberation of Hanover. Yeah, I mean, we are technically liberating them. And well, Prussian standards, but, uh, send the Air Force over there. So, at least try to help with the situation. Yeah, now, nah, there we go. Air, air superiority, it really seems to solve everything, doesn't it? Get some more fighters. Now that we have yellow air, this should make 
things easier. Um, yeah, so. Yeah. Why? We are in an offensive war. Bruh! Baby, let's just let this roll out. This is gonna be fun today, fellas. This is gonna be fun today. As Prussian troops enter Hanover, as the Russian troops enter Hanover, as the Russians make bold moves for the socialist. Agendas, uh, now, the socialist ideals, as the red giant grows, um, I forgot the national bird, oh shoot, as the fatherland grows bigger, I, I honestly don't remember the national bird of, uh, Russia, I think it's like a type of evil now. So, um, yeah, so, don't really know what to do. I guess we could take this city right in, well, there we go. So, well, that's them encircled. <laughs> okay, so let's back here. Okay, Hanover is mine. Not yet. Um, ooh, what is this? Oh, never mind. I thought that was Mexico asking to join us. I mean, technically they could. Like, it's meh. I should probably be working on this. Why am I not working on this? Um, let's just do... I mean, I want to do Bismarck's plan, but I guess I'll just do the Blade and the Forge. And oh, well. Hey, as them done with. There's another con, then there's another threat to our glorious empire demolished. Now we just need something to cover our, oh my god, France, what have you done? Um, geez Louise, um, France, what have you done? Um, France, what have you done? Okay, I'm not really going to worry about the Blade and the Forge, I'm going to do Bismarck's plan. And, let's see here, let's do this. There's four preparations done. And after we get more than 90, that, we should be able to do that. Russia honor restored. Tom Von Dezen becomes a field marshal. Oh, you're up! Pree. That's what that war was called that I couldn't figure out last episode. <laughs> oh, by the way, I forgot to say, um, before watching this episode, you should watch the other ones. They are very good videos, in my opinion. And might be in yours, too, but, uh... What? Who knows? So, um, yeah. Honestly, do not know what to do. I mean, I guess we could start working on... Uh, Sweden. Okay. So we we got we got we got Lenin, who has done this focus, and who knows he's probably doing the beacon of this, and then he's probably doing one of these. But in my opinion, he's probably doing the first five-year plan for opportunity in Asia. I don't think he's. 
We're doing dealing with the Hasbers. They got the Prussian question there. They're also in why are you calling me that? <laughs> Fortify the Polish border and the Austrian threat. Third international. We can be allies, crush on industrial zones, subjugate Balkans. There's a lot of decisions for Russia. Last thing I would have expected though was for um, Yenin to get in charge. Did I say Yenin wanted to get in charge? So I mean like, but things happen, this is a mod and I mean, there is no historical AI on this mod tech on me because nothing in here is historical, but I mean unless they were saying uh, Prussia wins the war and well, no, they're saying that's historical. That's whenever, like, you, you, you're basically saying, yeah, that. So. <sighs> just 20. Just 23 more days. Until we can declare the North German Confederation. Why am I missing so much support equipment? Oh, shoot. Not screw it. I need. That's fine. Division. <laughs> okay, I need at least 20. Okay, well, I can't do that without running out of it. Okay, I need at least 24 divisions. Because I need to cover the French front. Because they do have two options to go down. But they usually go down to break the brothers. And they will declare war on me, Prussia. So they could do law on the country in danger, which basically says, we're gonna keep out the Prussian Eagle, hold back the Italian. The defense against the Kaiser, and Elias Napoleon's pass. I mean, technically, either way, which side they go down to form Germany, you have to go down here. But I might get lucky enough just to do the Dutch state non whatnot. But I highly doubt it because I do have to go to war with Austria first. And that that that's just the pain of like that's just another thorn in my side. Like, how am I missing so many guns? You know now let's put you on high priority. Because pretty much the rest of the army is equipped. Almost at a million manpower, yeah, just like like these twenty four divisions is one percent of the army. <laughs> I think that's funny. Invite Sweden to the Brothers Coalition and declare the North German Confederation. Formation of the North German Confederation. I could use some stability right now. <laughs> if I do this, do I get stability or do I just get building slots? I just get building slots. Okay, so, um, hmm, I wonder if I should do this, and uh, focus on the Euro, okay, I wonder, okay, who won this? Oh, crap, the Austrian supported one's gonna win this. Oh, why well, can't Serbia might have a chance? They might. But now, it's time to prepare. For the inevitable. <laughs> Sorry. Um. Sweden has joined the Second Brothers Coalition. Welcome to the Alliance. Welcome to the Second Brothers Coalition. Oh, I just got more dockyards. Put more of them on submarines. Uh, do 
Oh yes, soon to have a third one. Soon to have a third one, which I can put on front. Okay. Um. Well, crap. Do the centralized control. Well, that's just great. Got camis in Serbia. And I wanted to let you know we are not Cammy. Not Cammy anymore. Well, not like full Cammy. I only use Cammy though. Look, <laughs> so we got three completely different people here because we have national syndicalism. Which is basically the exact opposite of what these people like. And I'm like, I hate both of them parties. Because I'm August von Mackensen. In charge of the North German Confederation. I mean, technically, I don't really have much I want to do if France does join. Because, like, either way, if... France is most likely gonna join, and I'm gonna end the series there. Um, dark. Oh, they are denouncing the Treaty of Vienna, which is that. The Treaty of Vienna, which has plagued Austria for over a decade now, has finally been officially torn up by the Kaiser! Dark days are coming. Yes, they are, but. So I think the Treaty of Vienna was whenever, yet again, I took these. Oh. Yeah. Okay, that's that done, and I think I'm going to be doing for a free journey. And that's where I'm going to end it here. Um, that's where I'm going to end it here for this one. And um, I do not know how many of the series I will have today exactly, but I do know I'm trying to get, I'm gonna try to get at least two out today. Um, the only reason I had three yesterday was because I had a lot of time yesterday, today, which I have no clue, but honestly, it just Oh yeah, it's, oh, the Bunderskrieg. How did I, I'm literally blind. It's called the Bunderskrieg. I am blind. So, he does, so I don't think he can do denouncing the Treaty of Vienna until he does this. Which now is, you could also do Fate, Fate the Favors, Fate, Favor, Fate, Favors, Fate Favors the Bold. On the offensive, the final showdown. And then we could also do secure Polish lands, which basically this is like yeah. a Europe, a new European order. The Hasbrook in charge of Europe. Couldn't imagine. So we, we could do our eye on Western Europe. Remember the Wolfen's Pact? Strengthen our navy. We're gonna do ties with Napoleon and do this. But if you do this, it's kind of like you basically kind of got it do here. Oh, so I think. Oh, I see what Carl's plan is. Carl's plan is to unite Austria and reform the HRE, or like an Austrian type HRE. Alrighty, well that's where I'm gonna end here, fella, fellas, and um, j jellas, like for boys and girls. You know what, ladies and gentlemen, I'm just gonna end this, ladies and gentlemen, boys and women. Um, I'm gonna end this video here, and uh, well, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I'm gonna end this video here. Uh, peace out, and I will see you with the second episode somewhat today.